So we have an eight picture deal with racers, so, and they're all like in the micro budget movies. So, you know, the idea is to come out with something that takes place in one location. So, uh, so we've been kind of banging our heads trying to come up with different ideas. And there was this one night that Steph and I were hanging out, and I remember running through the house and leaping into the bed to try, and I talked to her about, you know, remember when you were young and you tried to avoid what could potentially be under the bed, so you would jump from as far away from possible from the bed into the bed. And she said, that's a low budget movie idea. <laughs> <laughs> you don't want to talk about the bloody scene. <laughs> we didn't get too much of it just in the last, last uh, day or so, I guess. Yeah, it was pretty sticky. Really, really sticky. Because <laughs> we were, well, we got dumped I forget what day it was, but it was at least like not even halfway through when, yeah, it was really early on when uh, me and Gwen got covered in blood. And then of course we had to recreate that every other day. So, and the blood was really sticky because it's corn syrup based. So if you sat long enough, your arms would just like fuse to each other. Like it, you just, your skin just fused to itself. Um, yeah, but uh, we suffered a little bit for sure, but it was definitely worth it. I thought so. It was a challenging scene. Uh, it got rewritten into the death scene. So my actual death scene, I was stuck between the two queen mattresses or king mattresses for two hours, two and a half hours, three hours. Sealed right in there. Sealed right in there <laughs> with uh, blood just. How did I die? Cut in half, ripped apart. Oh, I think we want to. Do we want to see that in the bonus features? Yeah. 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 The 18 is, when I was young, the highest I could count to was 18, so says, when I say to my mom, I say, I love you, 18. Like, I love you the biggest number, so. <laughs> so we still, we still say, I love you, 18. Hi, mom, okay, see you later, I love you, 18. I love you, 18, son. And then I just threw the numbers on there, just a little nod. The, the carving was supposed to be like a head, a giant face looking down, but um, when, when it came, Back, it kind of looked like um, Burger King. <laughs> <laughs> so, it was beautiful, but it, anyway, it just wasn't scary. So it actually was, uh, again, Cody's father, Mark Callahan, who, who just shot us a couple of pictures and said, what do you think about this tree of life thing? And it had this sort of symbolism of the tree that becomes the bed. Um, and so then the cloud of ring, which is also Celtic, is just something that I always thought was really cool and romantic. So it's. It wasn't intentional to have all this Celtic symbolism, it just sort of happened. Actually, it was Cody who, who, who called me up like two weeks later after he's like, dude, uh, there's a film I think that has already been made and we were already well into development. So he sent me a link and he didn't have time to watch it. So I watched it and I was like, ah, I think we're cool. <laughs> and uh, actually I phoned, I, I spent about a week or so, we all spent yeah, trying yeah, to, well. to locate the director and we finally got through to him, he's in Michigan and I had a, like a two hour chat with him we talked about the movie, he was really thrilled, so we were still going to drive down to Michigan and show it to him, because he doesn't have a computer. 